So the new iMessage application just got updated inside of iOS 26. So let's go and take a look on exactly how to use this new particular application. Now, the big thing to keep in mind is that for the most part, when you go ahead and make your way over into iMessage, you're basically going to come into a page that looks something like this. So you're going to have your normal type of you know, page like this. In the top left, you're now going to have an edit button. If you tap on edit, it's going to bring you into this area, which allows you to see your name, select messages, and edit pins, pretty much similar to the previous one. We now have the filter icon in the top right, so we can see our messages, unknown senders, spam, recently deleted, and we can also manage filtering right up there as well. And then you have this centerpiece option right here, which basically allows you to have just a bunch of different types of you know, information and different things like that, which is actually really cool. And then you have your standard messages. At the bottom, our search bar is now there, so we can go through and we can tap into here and we can search for files or search for names or search for anything like that. So it's more uniform. I think all the applications now have a search bar at the bottom. And that's basically what you can do here now, which is actually really cool. Clicking X out of here, we can now compose new messages by clicking on the bottom right corner right here. So we can click right into there. We can also just go into and create a message. Now inside of our messages, the layout is a little bit different. So now you can see their liquid glass approach on iOS 26 is in full effect here because it kind of just is see-through at the very top. The back button goes back. The FaceTime button allows you to FaceTime and call those people. This middle button though is a little different now. If we tap into this arrow, it now brings us into this page. So this page allows us to basically see our info of that particular chat. We have a couple of different tabs here though. We have backgrounds iMessage now allows us to change the background of our particular photos or of our iMessage chats. So this is something that's actually really cool. You can now go through and you can change the background of these particular iMessage chats, which is insane. So if you want this one, you can choose this one and you can click OK. And it's actually pretty cool. Now you can also click on photos to see all the photos within that iMessage chat, just like this. You can click on links if you want to quickly see all the links of that chat. Documents to see all the documents that were sent within that chat as well. You have locations, if there were any locations sent, you'll see it there. And wallet, so if there were any payments or wallet transactions, all those things will basically come into this page. If you want to go back, you can tap on the back button right over here. And you have this new, you know, my message chat in the background with this new wallpaper, which is actually pretty crazy. And it's also a live wallpaper. Now the chat bar at the bottom is still the same. You can tap into here. You can still send out messages as you normally would. Everything's still the same. The plus button here though is a little different. If you click on the plus button, it does allow you to have this new option called polls. If you tap on polls, you can now go through and send polls with an iMessage, which is actually really cool. So this allows you to go and send out those polls. I think it's a really nice little feature that they threw in here. And you basically have that type of capability here when it comes down to it as well. So there's a lot of cool little things within iOS 26 and uh, you know within iMessage, that's basically a high level on essentially how to use it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Sullivan.